Hey Sagittarius, welcome to your reading for September. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get all the messages I post each month. And to my lovely loyal subscribers, welcome back. Let's see what we have going on for you guys. I'll leave information regarding what decks of cards I use and how to contact me for my services and personal readings in the description box, never in the comment section, guys. Okay, let's see what we have jumping out for you guys. Eight of Wands on top there. Communication. <laughs> Excuse, now you know why I don't have my face in the camera because... When somebody who blocked you, you know, left you with, when you wanted communication, they blocked you, left you with a broken heart. Now they're coming forward and blocking you, trying to plant new seeds. It's like they want to keep coming to you here to, I don't know, like, let's just have a look here. To know that they can have you. Six of Wands, they're going to say, yeah, I know you was the best thing since sliced bread. Um, but are they going to recognize here that they actually hurt you? They actually broke your heart, the Hierophant. Um, <clears throat> so you definitely learned a lesson in this. And of course, this can be a cross watcher as well. Um, it seems like you've been seeing signs from the divine here that they're going to come forward and reach out to you now that you've overcome these spiritual lessons here. Um, now that you see your own value. Um, so, of course, they see your value. Let's see. Nine of Cups. Um, I feel like this was at one point what you wished for. Now you're loving yourself. Let's see. You're going to be a little bit more cautious towards this person accepting an offer from them. Um, I feel like here this is just um, you protecting yourself in a very positive way in how you've learned to protect yourself, right? Um, you might feel like progress moving forward in love might be slow, um, but it's actually um, good for you what you're doing now. You're approaching things from a whole new perspective. That's awakening, seeing things from different angles, not blaming anybody here. Um, you just are seeing things differently and you have a slower approach to love. It seems even more grown up. Um, approach to love. So you have definitely grown throughout this, learned to love and care for yourself um, in a spiritual way rather than an egotistical way. I feel like you've learned so much and there's so much abundance here. You have so much love to give, but you're just not as willing to give it anymore after this heartbreak. But this person, what do they want to say? Let's have a look, because we're nosy. <laughs> Two of Swords, um, the Chariot. Um, they feel at crossroads in their life where they made a mistake, uh, you know, walking away from you, breaking your heart. Like I said, they're seeing your worth, what value you brought to them. But it's almost like you're choosing a new direction with the Chariot. It's destined to meet now, and this is why the Divine is allowing it, because you're strong enough and you love yourself enough to know like that if this person is indecisive about you, that no, I'm cutting them off. Let's see. Yeah, moving forward. If this person has healed and you want to be with them, this person could be your ninth cup. I would say check that you're thinking positively, okay? Because if you're indecisive and you're not ready, recognize that and move on in a different direction to continue on with your healing, um, to continue on with loving yourself here, maybe even your work that you're getting noticed for. That might be more of a priority for you right now. The six is related to the lovers, but it's related to health um, and your service to humanity. So you are moving towards giving back that way. I feel like you have established that already. It's not so much service towards humanity. It feels like I'm solely focused on me um, working things out here if uh, you haven't you know found your service to humanity these sorts of downloads will be coming to you now this is my career this is my calling 
those sorts of things you will be finding out right now or investing in going back to school learning new things um learning a new trade or something here you never thought that you could do this you know but it's actually a dream come true for you so if you're confused about what your calling is what do you love doing what's your dream what's your goals here if you don't have a goal you know this is something that you can work on then start writing these down start getting these ideas down because you're really now going to be motivated to do that to start giving back here to start moving forward and reach um, not only you know those spiritual goals but those physical goals in this physical 3d world that bring you success and victory triumph over these situations the chariot here is destiny wanting you to um, take control move in a new direction recognize when you're being indecisive recognize when you're being overly cautious and recognize if even if you are moving too fast right or you want things to move too fast slow it down right because you might be saying you know what um, i love myself this person's off as slow i'm off the divine's actually you know asking you to look within not be indecisive look within i think it was just scorpio i told this is like um action and reaction that you're looking at so you could be like fate destiny that sort of thing free will you could be looking into those sorts of things um but remain positive here i see you traveling um going somewhere by um overseas so it might be a holiday that you had planned with friends and family here um this is why we were getting our health in order looking good getting in shape or you could be going to learn about another person's culture watching a lot of things online about um you know another country here you're really engaged in learning something new if you're not it's a great time to do it get back to school um start a new job where you're learning something new here you will find that blockages are now removed out of your way in this instance this three of swords i feel like this heartache it's something that is still with you let's actually pull some more cards for that yeah they're definitely going to come forward and talk to you about it with the ace of wands it's an opportunity to make peace with that broken heart so even if you don't want to be together um it's an opportunity to make peace and speak about it you might even be um six of wands famous and speaking or writing about your heartache here or that might be your divine calling learning how do i get a book published i want to publish um you know my biography or a biography i i want to start a youtube talking about myself my experiences how do i do that it's a great time for you to learn and do that there okay yeah three of pentacles to start building on that um i think adele says it best um I turned my sorrow into treasured gold you're starting to build a foundation you know and being at peace with that and once you are at peace with that your peace will never be disturbed again here the lovers reverse so some of you are choosing that you don't want to heal this connection and others of you if you do want to uh, heal that connection somebody from your past this is saying that it can be healed but there's delays um so one is choosing not to heal it just yet but they're choosing now to communicate and you're choosing to communicate about this broken heart or maybe even writing songs or something here make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take a year from now a lot of people have been getting this a year from now i know it seems like a long time some of you are choosing a new direction as i said with the chariot there ask for help from others so you're having to ask people for help and support let go of control issues and you're seeing here that you know we are in control of everything we may want to be but we aren't and it's not a bad thing right coming from me a scorpio who's a control freak hate it when things are out of my control <laughs> um but yeah i feel like you've had to see when things are in the hands of the divine and when they're slow or that other people um it's in their hands i feel like you've learned a very you know long lesson waiting for other people yep solitude so you might have been single a while uh doing the internal work looking within um movement 
choices, decisions. That's the two of pentacles there. Um, when other people are busy, accelerated motion. Uh, this is eight of wands reverse. You've had to, while in hermit mode, put up with blockages and things not moving forward and people not making decisions, which is leaving you um, like not able to plot a path forward. So I feel like if you are waiting on somebody else and feel stuck, you need to choose a new direction. If somebody comes towards you here and they want to make an effort and to be with you, I would look at healing this over a year, okay? Because there are delays here, but great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So make the effort. If that's what you want, make the effort. If it's not what you want, you know, don't hold yourself back anymore. Create new opportunities if you think there aren't any. Create movement if you think there's none. Because the blockages are now being removed for you, Sagittarius. Have a good September. Remember, my details for personal readings is in the description box.